In this extraordinary episode, we were beyond excited to visit a mega celebrity, amazing talk show host and phenomenal animal advocate. Ladies and gentlemen, you know her and you love her. This is our interview of Ellen DeGeneres. surprise. I don't know that they knew you were here. Well, it's not just a surprise for us. It's a great privilege to be here. Thanks for asking us. It was uh, everything. Well, I called you. I was driving. I remember where I was. I was pulling onto the 101 and uh, I called you and asked if you would do this. And, uh, and I was really shocked that you said yes. Of course. We at WWDD just adore you, Ellen, and just admire you and all that you do. Let's start off by saying I love you. I think you're awesome. I have always loved you. I think you're just incredible. Oh, my dogness, Ellen. Ditto. I am just beside myself, but more than a bit nervous to interview you. I don't want you to have to worry about anything. You don't have to act differently. You just be yourself, act like yourself. You are too sweet and too kind. You're my first celebrity interview. I just don't even know where to start. Talk to me. You ask me questions. Okay, yes, but first I do have to tell you, you not only look even more amazing in person, but let me say, and this is important to any dog, Ellen, you smell incredible. I question your sense of smell. <laughs> you should never question a dog's sense of smell. <laughs> so, a question you want to question. Well, how about this? What's your name if there is anyone on the face of the planet who doesn't already know who you are? Ellen Lee DeGeneres. Google it, people. Oh, and if you have to Google it, you're officially dead to me now. She's Ellen! You should ask me some questions, you know, okay. like, you know, what I have planned for Thanksgiving, stuff like that. Oh, right. Questions. I actually am from Canada, so I've never even experienced U.S. Thanksgiving. It doesn't come to me top of mind that that's about to happen. You should come over for Thanksgiving. Oh, huh. that would be great. What a, what a great way to spend the holiday that I've never had. <laughs> Speaking of holidays... What's your number one gift on your list this year, Ellen? Mariah Carey's Christmas CD. Ooh, I love the sound effects. And yes, the girl can sing. So when you get together with family and friends during the holidays, what do you like to do? I like, I like poker better than blackjack. I do, but I do like blackjack. So a gambling gal. I like it. But I think it's taken more than luck for you to get where you are today. So many awards, great film and TV roles, and even a powerhouse producer nowadays. So you have my resume. Yeah, you caught me. I don't know how you do it all. You are incredible. Do you ever think about slowing down at all? I like to work. I really do because of, uh, because of what's it called? Money. <laughs> fair enough, fair enough. Aside from the money, though, I, I know the projects you're choosing must also be really rewarding, or you would just burn out. Like, you even worked over your summer, right? I was on vacation all summer. I wrote a Netflix special. I saved some gorillas. No biggie. She is too humble, people. My dear. She entertains. She inspires. She gives to help others. Ellen, you're just everything a person could hope to be. I am the full package. So, you said you saved some gorillas this summer. Tell us a bit about that, and why. So obviously I love animals, all animals, but especially animals at risk of becoming extinct. Agreed. I'm an animal lover as well, obviously. And there's nothing more tragic and upsetting than losing a species to just human greed in some form or another. That's the thing that's going to keep happening unless we protect these animals. Yeah. We need to protect the gorillas. There's only 750 left on the planet. Did you hear that, people? 750. Wow. They really do need our help to protect them. 
Well, I, 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 you know, have been in, you know, in love with animals since I was a little girl, and especially with the, the gorillas and, and really all of the animals in Africa that need protection, but specifically Diane Fossey. Diane Fossey, yes, what an incredible woman. And her legacy, thank dogness, has, like with you, inspired others to continue to help. Uh, Diane Fossey has been doing a great job for decades, and I'm joining forces with the Diane Fossey Foundation. That's spectacular news. So that's the Ellen DeGeneres Wildlife Fund? What a spectacular thing that is, and just never a better gift given. Your wife is amazing, but the work is ongoing, correct? So what do you need? As you know, I'm raising money to build my own campus in Rwanda to save the mountain gorillas. <laughs> yes, that's incredible. Your campus will help to continue Diane's work and protect these gorillas long into the future. Because we need to raise a lot of money to build this campus in Rwanda, so we're doing everything we can. Yeah, we all should do what we can. How can someone help, Ellen? And now you can donate to the Ellen DeGeneres Wildlife Fund and get something in return because we are selling these in the Ellen shop and online. You can have a t-shirt and also we're selling these adorable little gorillas. So cute. Love the shirts too. Where can folks find these? You can buy these at, uh, at the Ellen shop here or online, and all the proceeds to the Ellen DeGeneres Wildlife Fund will help save the mountain gorillas. So it's... Um... Perfect. These items and more people are available on ellenshop.com. It is the gift-giving season, so give a gift that gives back to the gorillas. Thank you so much. Well, thank you, and the gorillas, thank you. Of course. It's so easy to help. Look, what's your advice, Ellen, for those who want to do more to give back and to help out? Uh, here's what I would encourage everyone to do. Uh, don't ask what you can do to help. Just help. You're right. It is, it's just that easy. Just choose to do something. Like for us, we help in our own way with rescue dogs to help rehabilitate or foster them so that they can be adopted. Adoption is just so important, too. Agreed. Adoption is important. And I know you adopted your pets, too. I helped. Yes, you did help. We all tried to do our part. My mom used all the lessons she learned helping rescue dogs to write a book to try and help people, too. I read the book, and, and I, I know a lot of this, but it's, it's, uh, it's interesting to hear your, you know, really what your feelings were. Thanks, yes. Dogs have a lot to teach humanity. We all can do better, live better, and be better. That's what... What Would Dogs Do, the book, is all about. Oh, what a, an amazing impact that you've had on, on this country and, and all over the world. Well, I don't know about that, but we do want to inspire people like you do. You inspire all of us. Oh, pa shucks, Ellen. We just hope the book touches a few people and makes the world a little better like that. The book is fantastic. Thanks, we appreciate that. Hey, what's that you have there? Here's my book. I know. My mom loves your book. It is a fantastic book. That's what she said, too. She hasn't read it to me yet, though, so I can't vote for it, but I'm sure it's fantastic. Like you said. You'll start reading it when you get home. You're right. I can do that. I will. I will. So, beside your book, I'm excited about something else you recently wrote. Tell us about it. I wrote a, a, a stand-up uh, special for uh, Netflix, and it's called Relatable, and it comes out December 18th on Netflix. Yes, December 18th. The countdown is on, people, one month from today. So, Ellen, this was your first special in a while. How was it working with Netflix? It was fantastic. It was Thank so you. good. It was, uh, it was fantastic. That's fantastic to hear. They've really revolutionized the whole industry. They just produce so much great stuff, especially stuff that's released when? It's December 18th. It's called Relatable. I love it. Love the title, too. It's really an exciting time. Your creative vision is just everywhere. We also make original series that you can only see on Ellen Tube. Yes, I know. Those are great. The only thing you're missing... A fantastic dog show. 
We should really collaborate. My mom has some great ideas for dog-related shows that would just blow your mind and be so fantastic for your viewers to see and share. We would be good partners. Agreed. With our mutual love of animals and doing good, we could come up with some really fantastic revolutionary shows. You have your own series on Ellen Tube. <laughs> I know you're joking right now, but that would be amazing to do. But for now, what is the most important date for people to remember? Ellen. December 18th. That's right, just 30 days until... It says December 18th on Netflix. It's called Relatable. It will be fantastically funny. Great entertainment to watch again and again, just over the holiday season, and especially to brighten those wintry days ahead. Thank you so much. No, thank you, Ellen. You've made this dog's dream of meeting you come true. So I just, I can't thank you enough. Thank you so much. That was, that was incredible. I still can't believe that happened. It's, it was like a dream. Anyway, dream or not, I know where I'm going to be December 18th, sitting in front of my TV, watching Ellen's new special, Relatable, on Netflix. Put a reminder in your phone, people, December 18th, go to Netflix. You can watch this incredible, funny, entertaining woman in a great special. Relatable is its name. Be there or be square. And if you need any gifts this season, remember to head over to the ellenshop.com and purchase items that help donate to the Ellen DeGeneres Wildlife Fund to really help those mountain gorillas in Rwanda to thrive, survive, live. It's just, it's an amazing project and we are so happy to do anything we can to support it. So that's Scoop on the Poop for today. And remember, I'm here until we say hello again. If you like these silly dog shows, then subscribe. If you like these silly dog shows, then subscribe. If you like these silly dog shows and you want to watch them all the time, then why don't you click to subscribe or like us on Facebook? Ha <laughs> ha!